Hello everybody, I'm back. I'm gonna make one more video for today. And uh, like I said, I was doing lessons on how to play the tambora colombiana. And uh, I'm gonna give you a couple of lessons on how to play two rhythms, two fast rhythms. One rhythm you could do fast and slow and the other rhythm is generally fast. So the first rhythm is called puya. And that's a traditional rhythm from Colombia and it's a fast rhythm. Sometimes it's a slow rhythm and you could play it at carnivals, parties anything you know it's almost like a fast cumbia in a way like a cumbion but uh it's a very very good cool beat and uh i'm gonna show you some different moves on the on the parche and on the, on the cascara so va a hacer otro video y uh este video va a ser de, un, de dos ritmos colombianos el primero es la puya y la puya se puede ser lenta y se puede ser rápida y también voy a hacer un poquito de mapale para que vean so the first rhythm it's called puya, and puya is almost like a fast cumbia in a way. And uh, usually the llamador goes boom, 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 like fast cumbia. And the alegre goes, or the congas can go para para boom, para para boom, para para boom, para para boom. And the tambora is usually going. So let's let's learn what the trick is. So la puya es un ritmo rápido, es casi como un cumbión, como una cumbia rápida, casi. No más que el, la tambora va y el alegre le hace. So, vamos a ver cómo se toca una puya. So, the trick with puya is that you hit one hit and you muffle two. That's usually what they do. Some groups don't do that, but most people that play traditional Colombian music do it. So, it's hit and two muffles. And then you have the slap in between. So, the hit. So it's the trick is And you could do it at different speeds. El truco de la cumbia es que le pegas y entonces lo 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 callas. So there's different rhythms. So I'm going to show you how to do it fast. Vamos a hacer una puya rápida. If you could hold that beat down, you got it. As long as you could go. You know, usually my entrance to a puya, uh, mi sentada a la puya is like this. You could, if you're doing a slow puya, si haces una puya lenta, you could usually do the muffles here and the beat here. So, doing a, a slow puya in our group Puyacan and that's called Camisola and it's like a traditional song from Colombia and usually we do it as a slow puya like in this in this speed hacemos una canción que se llama Camisola que es una canción tradicional y la hacemos en mi grupo Puyacan y la hacemos en un speed más lento en un lo hacemos más lento la hacemos así Si lo hacemos, en ese son, y camisola, camisola, I don't remember the words to it, no me acuerdo las, las letras, but um, yeah, let's learn the rules on puya, there's a couple of different roles that I've been learning, vamos a, a aprender los uh, repiques en la puya, y aprendí como dos, y uh, les voy a enseñar, I'm going to show you the roles that I learned. That's 
one, that one's basically mimicking what the Alegre is doing. Ese, ese repique está uh, copiando lo que hace el Alegre, so. Let's do it slow, the one's set length over. So, ese es el lento, y así es rápido. Another one I've heard in a song called Puya San Jacintera, and uh, hay otro repique que he oído en Puya San Jacintera, and it goes like this. So that roll goes like this. That's one roll. So now I learned a little bit different little moves that you could do on, on Puya, and I'll show them to you. Hay otros diferentes movimientos que puedo hacer en la tambora que aprendí en Puya y te voy a enseñar. It's like this. So let's do a fast puya and then let's do a slow puya. And I'm going to do all the repiques and everything. I'm going to say una puya rápida. Y una despacia y en la rápida voy a hacer los repiques. I'm going to do the rolls on the fast one. One, one, two, one, two, messed up. Only una parte. But yeah, that's kind of how you do it. I'm still working on it. Todavía estoy trabajando en él. So una puya lenta. Wow. Puya lentas don't have a lot of rolls. A slow puya don't have a lot of rolls. La puya despacia no tiene muchos repiques, pero aquí va. It's a slow puya, you know, you could do them in different speeds. Esa era una puya despacio, lo puedes hacer en diferentes, uh, you know, speeds, como se dice en inglés. Pero, now let's do a puya, I mean a mapale. Mapale is a traditional rhythm from Colombia, and it's a very fast rhythm. There's, I've never heard a slow mapale, so I only know how to do one style of mapale, and that's what we're going to do, so let's do it. And there's different ways of doing it. There's rolls and stuff, but I don't know how to do the rolls yet. But as long as you can hold the beat down and you have someone on the alegre or the congas holding it down, you're fine. So el mapale también tiene diferentes repiques, pero yo no lo sé muy bien. Nomás sé lo básico del mapale, pero les voy a enseñar el mapale. We'll start slow. Basically, right, left, boom. Right, left, boom. Right, left, boom. So usually you gotta have a fast, a fast. You could also mumble it too. So you can mumble it sometimes and go loud in others. Why 
as you can hold down the basic beat, you're good. As long as you can hold down. You just gotta give it some accents. Tienes que darle un poco de, de diferentes sonidos como puedes uh, taparlo un poco. Mapale is a very traditional African rhythm from Colombia. It's, it supposedly means, it's what I've been told, it's supposed to be a fish. A fish out of the water and the dance, it looks something like this, like where they do something like this. And it's mimicking a fish outside of the water. And um, it's a very traditional dance, it's a beautiful dance. And no, oh, when you see women dancing it, it's over. But remember, right, left, both. Right, left, both. You got my palette. But that's all for today. I'll do another video next time of different rhythms. Gracias. Eso es todo por ahora. So para la otra, hago otro video de otros ritmos. Gracias.